This is my 555 contest entry. Um, the circuit here is a really simple circuit, and its purpose is for an audible level. The idea behind it being is that when you're trying to uh, make something level with the typical level, you have to constantly look at the little bubble in the glass tube and visually detect when you have a level um, surface. With this, the idea behind it is that I was going to use an audible tone, specifically two tones, um, which are generated with two 555s and a an, uh, three-axis accelerometer. The circuit essentially has a single 555 um, running a stable mode that is driven by, it's a voltage-controlled oscillator driven by an ADXL 330. Um, the two axes off the ADXL 330, in this case the Z and the X axis, are fed into an 508A analog multiplexer. There's a second 555 in the stable mode driving this multiplexer, switching between the two inputs at a slower frequency, um, which then drives the first 555 and the voltage control oscillator to generate a type of warbling effect um, to a small speaker. What will happen with this is as you're listening to it, you'll hear two distinct tones from the device um, in, as, as it is unleveled from the accelerometer. And when you reach a level portion, the two frequencies, the two voltages coming off the accelerometer will be the same, and you actually hear a steady tone. And that's what I'm listening for, is a, is a steady tone indicating um, the, the level surface you're going for. The way I have this circuit drawn up here is I'm actually looking for a 45 degree angle because I'm looking off the Z and the X axis from the accelerometer. So here's the actual circuit, um, two 555s, first one here, second one there. That one actually generates the lower frequency, it generates, or that drives the 508A multiplexer. Um, kind of a cool chip from the early 80s, pulled it off a um, old radar board, I believe. So it's kind of from the same era, which is kind of cool. And then the ADXL330 accelerometer, uh, hand soldered, because I wanted to make this work tonight. So powering up the circuit, um, from the speaker, you can hear the distinctive, um, very annoying warbling tone from the two voltages coming off that ADXL330. Now as I slowly rotate the board to 45 degrees, read at 45, you can actually hear the solid tone indicating that you're at a 45 degree angle. any above and below 45 degrees and the voltages come off that accelerometer are different and it produces the two frequencies you hear. You can actually see this pretty well looking at a scope as well. Um, there's the two frequencies and as they come together at 45 the sound continues as one tone. As a test, I was curious how accurate this was, um, so I actually took the device mounted to a board, and just by listening, I was able to draw a 45 degree angle within one degree, verifying it afterwards with a protractor um, and an actual level to make sure I was truly on um, 45 off of 90 degrees. So it does have practical applications. But Simple circuit I was able to throw together in the evening. And that is it.